Greetings, fellow Vikings. It is I, Neil, and welcome back to Pokemon Leaf Green Randomized Nuzlocke, episode 26. And we're gonna pick up exactly from where we left off, and let's pray to Arceus that we don't have to get through some more shenanigans when it comes to the recording. And I really hope so, because I actually just installed Windows 10, and I have had some problems, if you saw it on Twitter the other day, uh, I have I have had some problems with Windows 10 and uh, my computer <laughs> when I started up the game. Uh, well, not not the game, sorry. Um, the whole. Let's actually take on some trainers today. I still feel like I want to do that. Um, just gotta lower the volume because I'm not really used to this just yet. There we go. Sorry about that. Uh, I started up the PC after I uh, got Windows 10, and I do have two monitors, so left and right here. And the one that's above the webcam, no, the webcam is on top of my main screen, so to say, my good, um, really nice looking uh, monitor. And, uh, oh, the water gun. That stopped working. Uh, it apparently said that my other monitor is like a really cheap, uh, old, you know. Uh, that did quite a lot, but not too much. We can take that one more time. Uh, monitor that's not really that great. Apparently my computer said that this that's the main monitor, which is not. It doesn't even have that kind of cable that should act like a main monitor. Because you have like a specific cable connected to, to the PC that said like this is the second monitor. And apparently it said that this is the main monitor and it's like what the fuck happened? So apparently something went on when I did the update and uh, hold on, I have Volt Absorb, do I have Water Absorb? I can't remember, let's check that out for a second. A Volt Absorb, okay. Actually, then let's go into Body Cup. And um, I didn't really figure out what, what to do, and my internet didn't work. Like, what the fuck? So, apparently my internet said in my PC with Windows that I didn't have a real IP number for my router, which I did, because I called the company, uh, you know, the, what's it called? Uh, what's it called? The network company that gives me internet, you know what I mean. And um, my internet provider, that's the name, that's the name. And they said, no, no, nothing's wrong. Everything seems fine, but you don't have a wired connection. It's like, yes, I do. I have a wired connection from my PC down to my router that's behind that little curtain down there. You can't see it really, but uh, I do have a wire and it should work. And they're like, no, it uh, doesn't say that you have a connection. It's like, fuck, so there's something wrong with Windows 10 and my computer. They can't really cooperate when it comes to the internet. And I restarted my PC, and uh, the right monitor worked, not the main monitor. And internet started working, I was like, okay, good. So I just wanted to solve this, you know, screen thing, because I've been trying to, to do that for quite some time, you know, pulling out cords and restarting the PC, pulling out cords, you know, stuff like that. And, uh, you know, uh, quite frustrating, but then I actually got internet, but just one monitor worked, and I could update my graphics card. Uh, and it said that I had some drivers that I need to update and after that it worked you know my monitor started working so it was some kind of like um, my, my graphics card couldn't really cooperate with Windows 10 without getting an upgrade but I couldn't get the upgrade because I couldn't get internet but when I got internet I could fix the problem so now I do have two monitors and I do have internet because I just tried to do a lot of stuff and you know do some diagnostics and it said the same thing I tried to restart my PC and didn't work and I called the company and said everything should work I don't know why or how what happened but it started to work again after a while so now everything should work and I really hope the recording will work because I've heard that Windows 10 is quite buggy but actually it looks really great. I'm quite pleased with how Windows 10 looks. I thought it was gonna be like quite similar to Windows 8. Oh my goodness, I really love the way it's like so much more crisp to it and it's just like very simple to use uh, what I've had tried for so far. And I think that everything runs a bit smoother. Didn't I hit you? Oh, let's go for a leech here. Um, for like, a Example, when I tried to do some editing, editing today, uh, I just felt like my rendering program, my, what is it called? Yeah, well, the video editing program, uh, it felt like it was kind of smoother and that it like worked a little bit better and uh, that it like started up much easier and you know, it, it was just a bit smoother and you just feel like everything seems to be a bit smoother. Uh, so I'm quite pleased, I'm quite pleased with that. So uh, let's go, let's see, I'm just gonna swap out. I want to get Tyrant into this. 
Ah, I'm stuck in some kind of twist or something. Didn't see that. But everything seems to be working. Knock on wood. There we go. We took down the Vibrava quite some time. Um, and I just hope that it's going to be stable. And I just want to try out some, if, you know, new features. I haven't really tried out the new Microsoft Edge, which is like the new type of Internet Explorer thing, but it's like a new. And, and I've heard that some people say that it's actually good. And I haven't tried it out. And I gotta swap out. I can't stay in. Right, let's go into Katniss. I have heard that some people say that it's actually good. So I'm gonna try that out because I actually run Google Chrome. Uh, I do feel like Google Chrome is quite nice when you do YouTube and stuff like that. It's quite simple. But I'm just gonna try out uh, Microsoft Edge just because it's it's a new thing and why not really? Let's see what this person's gonna do. It's gonna heal us. Thank you, thank you, Delibird. I'm gonna one shot you with this flame flamethrower, so should be nice. That's great. So that's it. That's that. I've had some problems this morning. I got quite frustrated because me and electronics, you know, me and you know, uh, overall, what's it called, you know computer stuff and internet stuff it just like doesn't work I get so angry and frustrated from 0 to 100 in like two seconds uh, I just want it to work from straight away but it you know it doesn't work like that and that's quite frustrating for me because I really wanted to just work actually I'm gonna skip a few of these because I saw that we don't really have that much health I would like to <clears throat> train up my Pokemon but this super I right, want super potion we can give that to Saturn there we go, and I would like, actually, for Floater to get a high potion, just in case, because I want to use him a bit more. Uh, it, it would be nice to have a clay doll, to be honest. <clears throat> Let's face this girl here. I raised Pokemon for protection and something something, I couldn't read, because I didn't read. So let's see, we're gonna face Cyclist Jonathan would like to battle, since I an Abra. I'm gonna try and teleport away. Saturn, you're our beast. You can just go for a spark. It's... you're gonna teleport. You can't teleport. Oh, you're right. Uh, question of the day. Uh, I just thought of this, because... Not, not not just thought of this, but I thought of this question uh, in the last episode, and I want to start talk, talking about that, but I said that we could talk about that another time. And then I forgot what it was, but when I looked back to, to the video, I just remember what it was, what I wanted to ask. Um, what game, apart from Pokemon, do you play? Uh, it's quite an interesting question because I've never been that guy who plays a lot of games. Uh, I'm mostly focused on like one or two, maybe three games at a time at most, uh, because I'm that person who wants to, you know, complete or you know play something very. very oops, sorry about that, guys. Uh, hit the microphone. I want to play something very, very much for like a quite intense and long time. Um, for example, I do love the game called Monster Hunter. I'm a big fan of it. Love it. And actually, I started to play something called, it's uh, still in like an early access, it's called uh, Ark, Survival Evolved, and it's a very good game, to be honest. Uh, I kind of feel like it's a combination between, you know, kind of Minecraft, but with big-ass dinosaurs, and this thing has absorbed, but it's not going to kill us. Let's go for another spark, it's going to die. There you go, Enigma 2.0, or something, 2-0, minus 2. So I think it's a few experience, quite nice. We defeat the Cyclops here on the so it's not too shabby. But Ark is a very, very nice game. Look at this. We have an evolution. Saturn is evolving to Lantern. Yay! Every time. What do I tell you guys? <laughs> it's just so... Oh, look at that. We have a Lantern. Awesome sauce banana pants. Our Saturn evolved into a Lantern. Our Team Shao inverted evolved to a lantern I can't speak I'm so I'm so happy I'm happy today I don't know why but I'm just happy it's just it's great it's good to be happy uh, so it's nice and let's see we still have volt absorb that doesn't didn't get changed which is nice because it would be quite nice to take advantage of that um, actually now when I think of it, it would be nicer to have water absorb because we do have our future clay doll that's like run type like it's it's immune to thunder type th electric type uh, still the same thing, but still quite nice stats, you know, quite nice special defense, special attacks. We gotta take uses of usage of that. Uh, what nature do you have? Mild nature. Well, does that increase? What does that increase? Is it just... I don't know. I don't know the nature. For like the next... Let's play. I need to have like this separate sheet of, you know, natures and stuff like that. Maybe the next let's play actually will 
don't, and maybe I don't need to have something like that. Maybe it'll, it'll tell me. No, I'm gonna try to sneak past a few of these. And I'm gonna make like this sort of little grinding montage later on, like I just said. Uh, I just wanna make my way to the city today. Without whistle, I can summon bird Pokemon. Yeah? Oh, Jesus, fuck. Fucking bird. So, Servant Dudley would like to battle since out of Cubone. That's not a bird. I would like to see Cubone fly. You know, uh, you know what? We're gonna one shot this thing with our newly evolved little lantern here with the water gun. It's so good with water, to have water. Uh, headbutt, not gonna do much. We're gonna go for another water gun, because why not? It's really nice we can actually have like a really good typing again. Water and electric, you know, it's quite nice typing. But overall, thinking of uh, competitive use, actually Lantern, is, is it like NU? It's not PU, I think it's NU. It's not for use. Uh, I don't know, like, it's, maybe it's not that great. But for thinking like this, you can just a uh, let's play. La I think Lantern is quite a good Pokemon because it has like two very good typing, you know, water and electric. It's quite nice typing, and uh, having that either Volt Absorb or Water Absorb is very nice. Spoink. Spoink. Uh, what do you have, Spoink? What do you have, Spoink? We have Dark. We have Tyrant. Oh shit! We're so. Uh, no. What I'm saying. He can't touch us with the psychic attacks. He can't touch us. He can't touch us. Confused I'm confused and paralyzed and let's see if I can actually snap through and go for a knockoff. Gonna order sleuth, sloth, sloth, sleuth. Mm. There we go, should die. It's a spawn, it's a knockoff from a Tyranitar. What you gonna do when they come for you? Saturn Girls level 28, which is really great. Oh, look at that HP. Plus 4 HP, which is nice. Didn't notice that, but it actually has quite a lot of HP. Um, oh, now when I think of it, I think it's actually its best stat. I think actually HP is like its best best thing. So we have a Meditate here. It can't do much. That's still not a bird Pokemon. You have to send out two Psychic type and one Ground type. Is that Psychic fighting? Is it just fighting? Let's go for knockoff, see how much it does. You're gonna detect us. No. Pop. No. No. Double detect, there we go. Not a triple detect, he's gonna kill you. We beat Dudley. Dudley can do much. So let's just try and take make our way now to the city. Just wanna. Oh! Oh, there's an item up there! You gotta go get it! Oh my god, holy shit. You gotta go get an item. Must do so. Oh, Grimer, it's quite nice. Oh, oh, she missed this. Is that actually missed? I can't remember if I made the randomizer to tell me what it is when I pick it up or if it's actually gonna be something else. Yeah, it actually is missed. Okay, so it's gonna tell me what it is. Uh, so let's go into Fuchsia City, if we may. Uh, are you the kid who's working on a Pokedex? Professor Oaks A came by here. All right, but we can't get stuff from them because they want us to capture Pokemon. We can't really do that. Just go capture. Hi, you remember me? No. I, I can't remember his voice. I'm I want a Professor Oaks A. Maybe that. Uh, if your Pokedex has completed that own fifty. No, that's. Uh, isn't that the gym leader? Never mind. <laughs> we haven't caught 50 Pokemon. No, we haven't. Uh, I can't remember the, his voice. Was it like this? I don't think it was like this. No. It was something nerdy. I can't remember. Never mind, but if we're actually at Route 15. Is that the same route as this? Yes, it is. So we can't do much here. We can't capture. <sighs> we're in Fuchsia City! Finally! Let's just check out the city today, guys, because I feel like I want to do that. Ooh, do we actually get something here? I'm the fishing Kiros, oh, the brother! I simply love fishing! I can't bear to go without! Tell me, do you like to fish? Yes! Grand! I like your style! I think we can be friends. <laughs> just like his brother. Take this and fish, young friend! Get a good rod. But didn't we just get a super rod? Fishing this uh, blah blah blah. 
Hold on, let me just check out. I think I just got the sip rod, didn't I? All right, bag. Yeah, I have the super. Maybe, I, maybe I should have gone like the other way around. I'm not sure. Do we even have surf? Now, when I think of it, I don't think we have surf. I don't think so. We have cut. That's all. All we have. Have I missed something? Don't tell me I've missed something. We can actually get a sit encounter. Uh, you know what? Let's go to the Pokemon Center first, and then get us a city encounter for Fuchsia City. Alright, it's the city. Uh, oh, we'll get strength after this, right? That's right. Yes. Yes, but what if I say say no? No. Huh? Hell hey! Nope. Apparently not. Uh, don't know. He needs his teeth. I just remember that. Golden teeth. Where do we get the gold teeth? Safari. We get it from the Safari Zone. We gotta go to the Safari Zone to get the gold teeth. Look at my memory! I'm so shocked to even remember because my memory is awful when it comes to this, uh, you know, remembering stuff. You know what I mean? Ah, where's Sarah? I said to meet her here. Maybe she's lost, man. The item ball in there. Where, where you, where you want that? Where are you wanting that? What? Me too, huh? That's a Pokemon. Yeah, of course it's a Pokemon. It's a Voltorb. You can see it. It's got eyes. There's a. It's a Lapras. Oh, nice. Uh, let's see. This little boy. What do you want? Did you try the Safari game? There's some rare Pokemon that can only be caught there. Interesting, little man. Interesting. Now let's see what this guy wants to sell. You know what? Oh, you got you got ultra balls. I'm gonna snag a few ultra balls. Give me ten of those. Yes, please. Actually, I'm gonna buy a few super potions because they can be quite nice. Just to heal up like a small amounts of your Pokemon. Uh, full heal. I think we have a few of those by two, so we have fifteen. Nice, very nice indeed. Let's talk to these. Uh, don't they have any penance promoting the Safari Zone? How about some paper lanterns? Aren't they even any calendars? No, man. Did you try the X speed? It speeds up the Pokemon in battle. Yes, it does, but you know what? It's not really not that important sometimes. Speed is quite good in all the Pokemon games, but not maybe as much in a normal Let's Play. Oh, I wish I had a Kangaskhan baby. I'd love to. I'd love to be a substitute for the baby. Oh my goodness. A snuggle in the mother Kangaskhan's belly pot. You're a sick man! Can you teach me a substitute? Actually, no, I'm not gonna learn substitute. Uh, is this the Safari Zone? Awesome, so we can actually get a Safari Zone encounter, and uh, I just wanna check out the city. It's not too much left to see. We'll talk to that guy. Uh, what's this house? Pokemon Paradise Safari Zone. Is that also a, is that also a Safari Zone? Because I think I've seen it all. Yeah? I think I've seen that. Oops, and I have to go to the Pokemon Center. How, how do I get to the Pokemon Center? down here oh okay cool so there's the gym as well mm, not gonna take on the gym today uh, we've been playing for about 20 minutes ish almost soon oh it's kuga isn't that fighting it's bug i can't remember oh oh yes i'm the move deleter i can make pokemon forget the moves would like to do that no actually yes be wanting to delete cut from wingding and teach it to who was it Probably someone who's died. So we never mind. We can keep cuts because it's the only HE move we have. It doesn't matter because we only use Wing Attack and Wing Ding either way. So Bill files his own Pokemon data on his PC. Did he? Did he show you? No. The Safari Zone's Warden is old, but he's still very much active. All his teeth are false, though. We need to find his gold teeth. <laughs> you make me. He's been rich on. He always like collect the things he as a child. Yeah, I'm sorry if I, you know, destroyed your guy's uh, eardrums or whatnot. Uh, let's just heal up here and uh, talk to these people. There's a narrow trail west of Verdant City. It goes to the Pokemon Leech headquarters. Uh, yeah, we know that. Uh, you can't become a good trainer with just one strong Pokemon, but raising many Pokemon evenly is no not 
is no even ah, it's no easy task either. I can't speak. I don't know what's happening to my mouth. It's like if you're one if you're working on a Pokedex, visit the Safari Zone. It, all sorts of rare Pokemon bred there. Yeah, breed there. Bread, breed, not bread. Bread is something completely different. Different. So let's go actually and get ourselves the. I'm gonna use. Should I say super potion? No, not super potion. I'm gonna use the super rod. Uh, I was just thinking maybe using the good rod, but super rod gives a better chances of getting a higher level Pokemon, so we don't have to train as much. Not even enable. Not even enable. Let's go to the corner. Shane Fish doesn't work in this generation, but still, I don't think so. Not even enable. What the fuck? Not even enable. Maybe I can't use the super rod. You know what? Let's let's try out the good rod instead, because we just got the got the good rod. Not even enable. Come on. It's a Pokemon on the hook. Okay, we're gonna get the first gender for this set is gonna be a Drowsy. Oh my goodness. I'm not a big fan of Saki Pokemon, but it's our first counter and we don't have a Drowsy, so why the fuck not? I'm just gonna go for the Thunder Wave here and try to capture it with the Ultra Ball or something straight away. He's pointing at me, I don't like it. I don't like it. Let's go for a Great Ball, see if it actually just worked with that. Two, three, and we got it. A female drowsy. Hup, hypno. What do you name a female drowsy? What do you name a drowsy? I'm gonna think of a name. I'm gonna be right back. All right, guys, I am back, and I just don't know why, but I just feel like because it's in like it's in. Female drowsy, and when they become a hypno, they look very old, you know, look like you ain't gonna die any second, you know. And um, I just felt like, just because it's a female, I just want to name it Aunt something like Aunt. Let's name you Aunt Mia. I don't have an aunt called Mia, but we're gonna name this, uh, whoops, Daisy, it's that phone, man. Aunt, Aunt Mia, because why not? I think it's gonna fit quite nicely. Aunt Mia was transferred to Build PC. It was sent to Box in Valhalla. I forgot about that. We actually gonna have to go back and sort that out. I'm gonna do that super quickly. Where's the way? This down here, up there, and just a little bit to the right, and then up here and to the left. That's right. Actually, that was back, right front. There we go. Uh, move Pokemon. Yes, because we have two Pokemon that should not be in Valhalla. This, this is Mr. Peck. Peck, you have been partying way too much. Get back here. Peck, get back to the earth. And, uh, hey, Aunt Mia, I know you want to party. You, look at you. You just want to eat. I want that little piece of tea. No. You're not having any more tea tonight. And, uh, Mrs. Peck, you just gotta relax. You know, you gotta re relax. And no, 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 that's it, I guess. That's it. So, let's see. We've been recording for about 25 minutes. There's nothing else we can actually explore. I just want to check out this house to see what it is, it is actually. Because it's very interesting. Let's look, just check it out. Let's talk to this guy. Water Slowpoke is very knowledgeable about Pokemon. Oh, they talk very, very nicely. He even has some fossils are rare, extinct Pokemon. A Water Slowpoke came in, but yeah, I couldn't understand him. I think he's got a speech problem. Yeah, well, he has no teeth. Oh, we nicknamed the Water Slowpoke, you know. He has that patient look like a slowpoke. Well, that's not very nice of you. <laughs> hey, Mr. Slowpoke, you look old. Warden Slowpoke is running a promoting campaign right now. Try to get to the farthest corner of the safari zone. If you can make it, I'll win a very convenient. Pr you'll win a very convenient prize. Interesting, awesome sort of burning in up hands. Actually, guys, I'm gonna leave it for. Uh, leave it like this for the, today's episode. I'm lost. I don't know where to go. I think I should go up here. I would like, very much like to go to the Safari Zone then in the next episode. Uh, as a kid, I loved all the Safari Zones or the, you know, the bug catching contest. Oh my goodness! I thought it was such an amazing feature to the game. Um, and 
even though we can't just capture the first encounter in here, it would still be quite nice to go in there and see if we can find any good items. Because we have to go in there, we have to find the teeth. I don't know where the teeth are, so I might have to look that up, because I'm not a good puzzle solver thingy, as you know. Um, I have been Neelam, you know that for sure. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up down below and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. And Twitter is most likely here or there, somewhere in the screen. I don't know where I should put it, because I never know where the, the webcam, which way I look should be which way. I don't know which way is the corner. Or, never mind! I have been Neelam, I really hope you enjoyed watching this video. And if I don't see you next time, I hope I'll meet you at the gates of Valhalla.